Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Rusnaini. If you are new here, welcome. And if you are been following me for a while now, you know there is changes here. So you may may not know that I'm changing my channel's name and I also haven't posted anything for almost a year now because there's a lot of things has changed and so first I'm going to talk about why I'm changing my name. So my previous channel's name is my nickname which is Nenai. I got that name from my friends when I was a little kid. I like that name. I just feel like it's different. It's special to me and I change it to my real name which is Rusnaini. Rusnaini means the eye of the rose. Such a beautiful name and meaning, right? But I didn't like that name or I could say I hated that name for so long, more than 30 years in my life until recently I fall in love with my name because I got bullied so much when I was a little kid from my friends, my teachers, my colleagues. I was born and raised in small village inside the jungle. I grew up in a Borneo jungle, East Kalimantan, Indonesia. It's so common there in from where I come from uh, to have just one name. But I understand with kids being kids, you know, they like to tease each other uh, and but also my teachers, they also like to tease me with that name because I only have one name. So I create judgment to myself because of what people say to me about my name. So with that, I, <laughs> I do a lot of forgiveness to myself. Um, and also it's because the spirit guides been telling me you need to change your name. But I just, I'm so rebel. I didn't listen until last month. I, it's like final. It's like so strong. Like you need to change your name now. So I did it at that moment. So yeah, here I am changing it to my real name. And the other changes is... As you see, I haven't posted anything for almost a year now because I've been learning, growing, and evolving. I am transitioning my YouTube channel from hair, workout, and face videos to spirituality. And I feel like that is so me. And the other side also so me, but spirituality is the truest of myself so being deep in spirituality is not something new to me no that is not something that I just learned or I just discovered no so I was born with this already I was just afraid to show to people because I was so afraid of being judged that is why I am I've been hiding inside the closet and yeah, until the spirit guides like tell me like, come on, you need to do this now. We need it now. I was like, okay, fine. I'm going to do it. It was so uncomfortable for sure. hundred percent sure. As I'm learning, growing and evolve, I wanted to share what I learned because I don't want to lose that side of me who always wanting to learn because every day is learning process. Every moment is learning experience. So I want to share my experience and I want to share what I learned from that experience so that it can help you also with whatever that you are experiencing. I always been happy person, but there is a gap inside of me that I couldn't explain what it was. So I was confused. I so much confusion inside of me that it just like create more confusion. But it really simply I was going through the spiritual awakening 
that nobody taught me or nobody told me nobody can nobody can tell me okay you are fine you are okay you are in the right path so <laughs> um so yeah i also want to share about so many things in a spirituality where i believe it could help everyone who are going through this awakening journey many people out there are going through the same experience or same things as me uh, but they just don't know who they can talk to or what they need to do because it's just not something that we can talk about to everybody I could help you and guide you to walking this path so you don't feel alone you don't feel like you are an alien or you don't feel like you are crazy because all of those things I felt it before where I couldn't say anything to everybody because not everybody could understand how I feel inside what is going through with me uh, I hide it all alone. This is why I come here to share my story because I have learned with so many amazing people. It, my life path is very interesting, I could say, because I always connected to the shaman after shaman after shaman after shaman. And those are shaman that are very, very, very powerful shaman born and raised in the borneo jungle you can imagine that we we really live inside like in a small village inside the jungle so we don't go to the uh, doctor when we get sick we don't go to the doctor for everything for anything we don't go to the doctor we going to the shaman even here i live in us now I also connecting with the shaman so I have the ability to see you see my name eye of the rose and I also have the ability to see what does that mean so for example I could see when people send me message for example I could see where they are coming from like are they coming from desperation or are they coming from happy peace i can read i can see their energy their vibration when they are sending that message or i can even see when people are telling the truth or not i could see that and what i'm doing is i'm helping people simplify their life make things so easy because everything should be easy i believe in myself that when things are difficult it just doesn't meant to be for me because my life path is everything's easy for me everything so i always see as okay when i am doing the things then and i make so much effort on this okay i'm not gonna do that because that's not my path not that i said that i i am easy to giving up no but i am just knowing i have an inner knowing that i know in this journey my life path things just easy so if it's not easy i'm not gonna do it i'm just gonna waste my energy and i don't want to do that so going forward i'm going to use this platform use this youtube channel to talk about spirituality because i know so many people out there apparently going through the same thing as me and i am here i wanted to help i want to share the message that you are not alone don't ever feel like you are left out or you are lonely no because so many people out there are going through the same thing as you you just don't know them you just don't know it so if you are going through this spiritual awakening so this video is for you and going forward i am 
going to share about more stuff about this about the ancient wisdom about so many things that it's going to simplify your life and so yeah i hope this video is helpful and thank you so much for watching and i see you next time bye